Well, the 2023 Panhandle Pumpkin Carving Contest here at News 13 has come to a close. We had nine entries overall, and we did have a winner, but we had quite a few honorable mentions as well. Yeah, I can tell you who didn't win, me, because <laughs> I can't carve pumpkins. And some of the honorable mentions are Rooster by Amy Campbell. Is that Rooster there? I don't know if that, is that Rooster? I'm not sure. Uh, so. Missing Link by Andrew Wiggins. Oh, I, I love that. Oh, they're so cute. Yeah. The Frenchkin by Mary Wooded. <laughs> Look at that. Now, that, that took some time, yeah. too. There's a lot of good detail there. Oh, yeah. How about uh, Bigfoot? It's just called Squatch by Bill Pearson. <laughs> That's pretty. I like that, man. I That's like pretty that cool. I like that, too. They even, I think, glued some leaves yeah. onto the pumpkin, too. Great wow. touch. Pretty cool. Uh, Halloween Mickey by John Porica. Wow. Porica. That, that has a lot of good detail, too. Wow. These are all so good. But here's the winner. Your winner, Bride of Frankenstein by Jimmy Carmen from right here in Bay County. He said it took about 10 hours to carve. And the detail, I mean, the hair. The shadow. I mean, just the, the texture yeah. to this. Wow. I don't know. Wow. It said it, he said it took him 10, more than 10 hours to carve wow. that. Wow. And yeah, you can you can definitely see there was a yeah. lot of effort put into that one and all of these. So thank you all so much. Yeah, thanks for playing. Yeah, carving. <laughs> yeah, carving and playing. And we'll do it again next year. All right, maybe maybe we can pull out our best effort. Which I don't know if you've seen Chris best. carve a pumpkin. It's it's an ugly sight. I mean, really I'm not is. any good at it either, though, so I'm not one to talk. Yeah, we're not we're <laughs> the most creative individuals. We'll hire Chad Ganey to do it. There you, know, you go. Pass off as our own. <laughs>